It looks something like this. Hello gorgeous, welcome back to my channel. We got another Target haul coming at you hot. I apparently live my life at Target. In case you are new here, welcome. Um, I haven't done an intro like that in a while and I thought maybe it was time, but I am kind of um, your go-to girl for all of the things, I love all of the things, but mostly I focus on budget-friendly stuff, whether that's makeup, beauty, fashion, home decor, everything, I, I kinda do everything here, don't I? which means I probably do too much. Anyways, I ran to Target today. I got on stories right away and said, hey, I think I'm gonna film a haul for y'all. And everybody on my stories is like, yes, film a haul. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna show you what I got and I got some good Christmas stuff. Let's do it. Okay, so we're gonna go in random order because everything right here is spread out all over the floor. The reason is, is that Kenny, Again, if you're new here, I have an uh, almost three-year-old. Her name's McKenley, we call her Kenny. She came in and she wanted to go all through the bags to look for prizes, which is surprises, because anytime I come home from a store, she thinks that, you know, she gets a surprise, <sighs> which means she's spoiled. <laughs> anyway, so things are just all over the floor and I'm just gonna grab them and show you what I got individually. Some of these things are going to overlap with another video, because I'm gonna, I'm doing a sweaters video as well. So if you see sweaters here and in a sweaters video coming up, never mind. Just, just roll with it, okay? All right, so first, we have Christmas stuff. Honestly, that was the majority of this haul, is Christmas stuff, because I am in full mode Christmas 2020, because Halloween is over, and when I woke up on November 1st, I'm like, you know what, it is fair game. We've already been listening to Christmas music. We have watched Mickey Christmas so many times already this year because Kenny is obsessed with Christmas. And I have a different house than I did last Christmas. So that means I have different needs. Different. It's like I'm talking about a marriage here. I have different Christmas needs and different Christmas trees and decor. So I'm kind of starting from scratch in a way and I'm bringing you along. So. One of my very, very favorite things to decorate with for Christmas is red berries. I feel like nothing says Christmas like red berries. I love vintagey feeling Christmas. Like anything that feels like this could have been in a home in the 1940s feels so good to me. I love that so much. And berries just scream vintage Christmas. They were probably real when they originally decorated with them, but I fill my trees with them whether they're, whether they're red or white. But I bought these garlands, they were $9.96 I think, and um, they're Threshold brand, they're five feet. I bought them because I'm going to either wrap them around one of my trees or I'm going to use them in my centerpiece or use them on, an, there, there's a million ways I could use this honestly. I can just keep going with you. I mean like even like the tops of my um, cabinetry, like having red berries stick out, so pretty. I just think that this just is just the prettiest and easiest way to decorate for Christmas and spread some cheer throughout your home. I found these in the dollar spot and I just thought that they were so cute. They're little stringy looking stars and they're glittery, but it's actually string lights and there's six warm white LED lights on them and it goes two and a half feet. And I did a very, very thin pencil tree in Ken's room. They're battery operated, so I figured I would just swoop them down the tree just for a little extra glow, but they were $3 and they're so cute. And if I love them, I'm gonna run back and get more. But I thought this is a, you know, it's just cute, a cute way to add a little bit of warm glow. And maybe even if not on the tree, then I might add them to the top shelf in her room. I'm, I'm getting ready to take down all of the decor on her shelves and put all Christmas stuff up because I'm that mom. Another Christmas item that I found in the dollar spot are these little houses, these little, yeah, they're just houses, but they're so cute and they're ceramic. There's two of them in there. They're battery operated, so they have little lights inside of them. And it was $5 for the two and I thought these are really cute to light up on her on her shelves. Kenny loves anything that lights up. We have a little um, thing in her room that lights up and puts stars on the ceilings, ceiling at night and like she just feels like that's just absolutely magical. So little, little light up houses on her shelves, she will love that. I wish that they were remote operated because you're gonna have to get them down and turn them on and I can just see her trying to climb up to get them. Um, but for $5 for two, they're really cute. So I probably am gonna have to put them down somewhere low so she can turn them on and off herself because she's going to want to. So Ken's tree in her room, I really focused on her room today. I just realized as I'm sitting here, I didn't buy any Christmas decor for any room <laughs> hardly, but her, her room, so it is what it is. I did a pencil tree in her room and it is seven feet tall and it's, how much was it babe? 74, 
59th, 59 I think, from Walmart. And it's when I say pencil, it's like about that big around from top to bottom. It's not very big at all. And Matt was trying to talk me out of it when I bought it. He was like, do we really need a seven foot tree in her room? But he didn't question me once it was up in her room because it really is thin and it's not substantial and it's perfect for a kid's room. And I just filled it with all kinds of just sparkle, glitter, Christmas ornaments, all shatterproof and total. I wanna to say total on the tree, I spent under $100. And this is a tree that we're gonna put up for years to come because it is just so pretty. It's blush and white. I will show you guys a picture um, at some point soon here on my Instagram. But I found these blush icicles and they're just so cute. I, I really love this color theme and it's $3 for the box. But if you love rose gold or blush, these are really, really pretty and a really feminine touch to any tree that you might be working on. Another thing that I bought, is a big old candle for Ken's room. Obviously, I'm not going to leave it on when, she, when she's in the room by herself, but I just thought that it would be nice because part of our bedtime routine is, is that uh, Matt and I go into her room every night. We read books together, we read three books, and she has a cookie and her milk before bed. And I thought, how nice will it be as the weather gets colder and we have her room decorated and we have the lights going, if I go in a little bit ahead of time and light a candle and just like really have the room smelling good, I'm all about ambiance. Can you tell? Like I have candles on every nightstand. I have greenery on every nightstand. I have greenery all through my house. I really love setting a mood, setting a tone, and this is divine. It is a Threshold brand candle, vanilla gingerbread. I wanna say it was $10 and it smells so good. It says all is calm, all is bright. Isn't that sweet? And it's gold and white and it just really matches her room and it's gonna be so cute in there. I told y'all I love the red berries. They are just Christmas to me. Red berries are Christmas to me. They're just so simple, but yet they add a, a punch of color. And then I loved these because it's got the stark matte white with the red berries and they were $5 each. They're Threshold brand, potted faux plant. Um, I think that they're just adorable and I'm going to probably put them in our guest bathroom. I'm not really sure yet, but we're going to be hosting Matt's family for Christmas this year. At least that's the plan, Lord willing. And if that's the case, I wanna decorate the guest bedrooms as well because when they come in, I want them to feel like they're here for a holiday stay, and the holiday vacation, a holiday in Nashville. And I just, I really wanna just bring that holiday feel into their bedrooms and into their bathrooms as well. Guys, I don't know if you can see beside me right here. Yeah, you can, I'm looking at the screen. The sunset is unreal right now. You can see how on this side, how pink over here. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. It's like God took a paintbrush and just, I feel like we're down in 30A. Okay, something that I love and I've already done a couple of posts about is matching PJs for the family for Christmas and Target has an entire, at least ours did, had an entire wall of matching PJs. They're already getting picked over so if you do want matching PJs, now is the time to snatch them up because they're gonna be gone. I would say within the next two-ish weeks, you're not gonna be able to get them at Target anymore. And it's because they're, they're so reasonably priced. I grabbed this set and I am just, I'm just loving it. Can you see, you probably can't see what they are, but they are a set for Ken, me, and then Matt. And then they are Mickey and they're vintage Christmas. He's in the vintage red truck with the Christmas tree in the back. And oh my gosh, they're just so cute. They're like a flannel, they're really soft. And Kenny, I know is gonna be so excited to put on, she, she calls Mickey she, she she's gonna be so excited to put on she, she pajamas tonight. So, because we're totally gonna wear them as a family. We're gonna rock these bad boys. I couldn't pass up these little ornaments for her tree because they are blush and white and they're just so cute. I've talked about before, I love gnomes. And this is a little blush and white gnome. So cute, it was $3 and then, a little ballerina mouse with the, the white and um, gold, which is totally with matches her bedroom. Again, $3. And these were $3 also, they're little reindeer and they're just so cute. And they have such good detail on them. This one's got little um, gold stars and pearls stitched on it. And then this one's got a little furry with glitter. They're just, they're just really cute. And I cannot wait to add these to her tree. They're just going to add a little personality because her tree is just the um, like, the classic white snowflakes and then a whole bunch of different bulbs that are blush and gold 
not really white, mostly blush and gold. So putting those on there is just gonna add a little bit of texture and just make it a little bit more interesting. Next, I found this pillow and I thought it was just really, really sweet. I'm gonna put this on her couch in her room. It's got little touches of the blushy pink. And the reason that I, I'm really searching for blush and white toned items is because her room is so specific. She's got white walls and then her ceiling is that blush uh, floral wallpaper, which I absolutely adore. It's a Joanna Gaines wallpaper and it's absolutely beautiful, but it feels very spring. So working Christmas into that is tricky. So in order to bring colors like red, you gotta be able to work it in. So this has the blush and it's got like a mint green, the red, and I just love this pillow. I think it's so sweet. I actually saw this on Casey Wygan's Instagram store and I was like, oh my gosh, that is so cute. And then I went into my store and they had it. So I was really excited about that. I also grabbed this one with the good tidings. I don't know if I'll, I'm actually probably not gonna put that in her room. I'm probably gonna put this in our bedroom because it's just very sweet and simple. This one, let's see, is there a price on this? Hmm, no price, let's see if this one has a price. This one was $20. So I think this is really, really cute and $20 for a throw pillow is a great price. All right, this was a big daddy purchase. Ugh, like really. This is a huge knit blanket and it's a king size. And it's this really pretty winter white. And my idea is to layer this on our bed. <sighs> I love our bedroom. I love the bedding colors. I love everything about it. But the blue Euro pillows behind me, they're not gonna stay for Christmas. I am very big in Christmas bedding. I'm actually on the hunt for the perfect crib sheets for Kenny's bedroom. And I'm having a very hard time because for whatever reason, nobody really does great crib sheets. I've checked Pottery Barn, which they have some cute ones, but they're all very basic colors. And I want, I want something specific. I have it in my mind. I wish I could just go out and design my own fabric. If so, then I would take it to someone and have them make me a sheet, but I can't. So I am getting ready to do, oh, my bra's hanging out. Sorry about that. Just giving you guys a free show, you know? Um, anyways, I, I'm going to do all of the beds in Christmas somehow, some way, and I'm gonna do it very affordably. I don't, I am not somebody who skimps on bedding because you spend so much of your life in there. However, when it comes to doing bedding that's not going to last, it's not gonna be something that you're gonna use every day for the rest of the year, I'm not going to spend a ton on it. And there's so many great options that are affordable and soft, all of the things, and that's what I'm gonna look for. So let me know in the comments below. If you guys wanna see some of my bed makeovers for Christmas um, and the linens that I choose to use for Christmas, let me know because I can easily film a video about that and that would be actually really fun for me because that's probably my favorite thing about home decor is designing beds. Not designing beds, but putting together beds. I just, I love it so much. But this is gonna be really beautiful. This is the brand Casa Luna. This is a newer Target bedding brand. Um, at least it's newer to me. I don't remember ever seeing this until recently. This is the Knit Blanket Size King Medium Weight and it's machine washable, which is awesome. I wanna say it was $69.99, which is hefty if you're not going to use it all year. I get that, but this is something that I'm gonna keep on the bed through the winter months. Christmas, beyond Christmas, you get the picture. And it is very heavy. Like, it's actually like weighted, they say medium, I would say this is more than medium, personally. But it's really beautifully done. This is something I'm really excited about, and it comes in other colors too, if you're interested. I mean, it's so cute. It's so cute. Matt, or Kent, Matt, yeah. Kenny calls Santa ho-ho, so we got a ho-ho soap pump, and it's so cute. And I wanna say it was $5. It's just cute. I don't know, it might go in her bathroom, but I kind of feel like I wanna put it in the guest bathroom downstairs so that everybody sees it and gets to enjoy it because it's just so cute. Moving on, we are now done with, the, done with the home portion. We are going to go to clothes. I did not go in with the intention of buying myself any clothes or even looking at clothes, but you don't go into Target and tell Target what you need. Target tells you what you need. You know what I mean? You go in and Target's like, oh, oh, come over here, come over here, you need this. And then it turns out you really do need it, guys. These pants are like heaven. They are the softest, most luxurious feel. And if I told you that I was going to not wear these when I stopped filming, I would be lying because these are going on my body as soon as I stop filming. They are the Stars Above brand. I'm gonna, I'm gonna link everything below for you guys. I forgot to mention that in the beginning, but obviously everything's linked below. These pants are everything. Do you guys remember my 
Amazon haul like a couple months ago and there were the joggers that were $15 that I loved. Hundreds of you guys bought those and you loved them. These are even softer. They're like the winter version of those because they're like a softer, thicker, buttery. I love that word. They're buttery soft. They're incredible. I got them in a size extra small, $19.99 worth every stinking penny. I got them in the white. They're more of an ivory. They also come in gray. These are unbelievable. And you're welcome. That's all I got. You're just welcome. I did not need another robe, but I touched this robe with my hands and I could not leave without it. It is so soft. It's like wearing a incredibly amazing cardigan. This is a barefoot dreams dupe. That's what it is. It is a barefoot dreams dupe and it is amazing. I got it in the extra small, small. It's $37.99. And the thing that I like about it is the length. For whatever reason, lately, finding long robes is hard. And it's like, when it's cold out, you don't want short robes. You want the warmth all the way down. You know what I mean? It sounded like I'm talking about peeing your pants. That's all. <laughs> ah, you get it. Anyways, this is incredible. It's so soft. It comes in white. They did not have it in white in my size, which I was bumming about because you guys know I always lean towards anything that's light, bright, and airy. But it was so soft, and it feels like the, the best sweater ever. I could not leave without it, and I am, it's amazing. I showed this on my stories like a week ago, and I wanted to throw it in here so that you guys could see it because not all of you catch every single Instagram story that I post, obviously. I don't catch every Instagram story that I post. <laughs> Anyways, this is just too cute, and I'm probably gonna be wearing this on Thanksgiving day while I'm cooking. It's apple pie. Turkey, pumpkin spice, bonfire, pumpkin, cozy sweaters, fall leaves, red wine, and cornucopia. It's just so cute. And it was $14.99. I went with the extra large because I want a very like loose, oversized fit. And it's gonna just be really, really cozy and cute for Thanksgiving. And I bought it in store, but I'm sure you can find it online too. This shirt, I'm very excited about. It's like a mauve, which I feel like mauve is the, co the color of fall 2020. Mauve and, and rust. Those are the two colors of, of fall this year. This is really, really soft. Oh, did I just pick it? No, I didn't. Okay, good. It's really soft. It ties in the front. I went with a size large because I want the oversized fit. And it is just really, really cozy, comfy, and it's lightweight. So if you live somewhere like Florida where you want to have the sweater going on, but it's still too warm to wear them, this is a great option because, like I said, it's super lightweight. It's $15. It's Wild Fable great color. It's going to be super flattering on most skin tones. I love this and I, I can't wait to style it. Okay. Last thing. Oh my gosh. I'm finally done. Can you believe it? I feel like I've been talking for hours. Okay. This sweater is so cozy. Oh my gosh. It's so soft. It's so cozy. And look at the sleeve detail here. Do you guys see that? It's got like a pleat going down the sleeve. So it's going to give you that balloon sleeve detail, which I absolutely love. I went with a size large. I would normally be an extra small, but I wanted the large because I want, first of all, it's more of a cropped style and I want that longer fit so I can like do the sloppy tuck in the front. And it's just a really, really well-made sweater. The brand is a new day. It's $27.99. I'm really excited to wear this for fall. Y'all, that was a lot of stuff. I think that I did really good and I'm really excited to see all of this come together. I will definitely share with you guys the Christmas decorations as they come together. Again, it's I'm just doing a little bit, a little bit, a little bit because it's so early. I typically wait until closer to Thanksgiving, but every year I've just been getting to the point where I'm decorating earlier and earlier and earlier. And this year we've got COVID and we've got just craziness happening. So it's like, we need all of the joy and all of the cheer and all of the festivity that we can possibly have in life. So why not decorate early if that's what makes you happy? So that is what we're doing. We are subscribing to the, what makes you happy, do it. We're, we're doing that in our house. So I hope you loved this video. Leave a comment below and let me know what video you wanna see from me next. Again, everything that I talked about today is, is in the box below, right there. I've had a bunch of you guys ask, wait a minute, where do you link it? It's always below in the description box. Just click that little arrow and then it will expand and you will see every single item by name and beside it is the link on where 
you can find it because I know it's a pain to see something and then have to pause it, go and type it in and figure out which one it is. Don't worry about it, it's all linked below. Also, I wanna share with you this shirt. This is a Walmart find, 11 bucks. Isn't it cute and it's so soft? I'm wearing my normal size extra small in it and it is just cute and the sleeves are long for my long arms. So I'll link that below for you guys too. All right guys, thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and feel free to share the love and share my video with anybody else who loves Target as much as we do. Because if you're watching this video, you love Target too. Girlfriend, I know. So it is five o'clock and it's time for my coffee. And I will see you guys next video. Au revoir. Isn't she beautiful? It looks a little bit blown out here on camera. So I'm gonna in put some insert shots so you can see the color beautifully, perfectly. The only word that keeps coming out of my mouth when I look at the, this is